You know, so should we start our discussion now? So the this topic of our discussion is public transportation, and the main uh, focus is: Do we think that people should be encouraged to use public transport transportation nowadays? So, for me, in my opinion, I think people should not be encouraged to use public transportation because I think uh, this will cause some problem to the people or the passengers. Uh, mostly. It will cause the people or passenger to be late to the office or to the school or to the whatever the place where they want to go. Uh, this is because public transportation is not being cared so much uh, by the company that is uh, the company of the tra public transport. We could see it uh, around us. The public transportation like bus or taxi or monorail or other public transportation in some cases they will break down and this will cause the people maybe the people who is rushing or the people the the student that is late for going somewhere and this will cause them to be more very late to the place they want to go so I think it is very problematic for them so how about you Malik? Do you have to agree with me or not? I think your point makes sense, but for me, I agree with the assessment that the people should encourage to use the public transport. Because when the people use the trans uh, public transport, it not only uh, can reduce the number of cars on the road, but uh, also it can reduce the our uh, our environment, reduce the pollution of our environment. When the when the the number of cars reduce on the road or the number of physical reduce on the road, it can also reduce the traffic jam. It can also avoid the people from getting late to the place that they want to go. Can I interrupt this? Okay. Uh, do you think that uh, transport vehicle like bus and lorry and the big vehicle are the cause that make the traffic jam? Right? I don't think so because the car, the lorry, uh, you say the car, the lorry, yeah. When they are too much, the big transport. Oh, they are slow. They, I, I think they are the main problem. The main cause for the traffic jam. Public transport not only include the bus, but also can include the monorail, train, and so on. So I think that uh, the the bus or oh, the bus drives too slow and something like that. I think the way the solution is, we can increase the effectiveness of the public transport. That. Do you understand what I mean? Okay, yes. Okay. Um, it also can... Let me... Uh, co let me... Continue. Continue my my point. It also can reduce the our environment, reduce the pollution of our environment because the, tra the, the car or all the vehicles, they can... Uh, they will make... They will... They will release the... The, the harmful gas like the carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide and it can cause the, the disease something like heart attack or asthma or something like that so when the car is reduced the, the, the gas, the politic gas also reduce so it, it can reduce the, our, our it can reduce the pollution of our environment and make a healthy lifestyle so, so what do you think uh, Fadila? Uh, I agree with you, Malik, uh, because uh, I think uh, people should be encouraged to use public transportation, especially for the student, because uh, the cost for the public transportation is cheaper than the private uh, transport. Uh, for example, uh, uh, as we all know, uh, the student, uh, when uh, they want to go out from the uh, university, they can use a bus, taxi, or commuter uh, so they they also uh, not more thing about the uh, not more thing about the to good uh, so the student uh, no longer have to worry about fifteen uh, the ten or uh, with gasoline which is getting more and more expenses uh, by this day so uh, they can uh, cut down the their money to buy uh, the uh, the other thing. So 
I think uh, the, peop uh, the people, especially students, uh, should be encouraged to use public transportation. Uh, what do you think, uh, Asti? Okay, uh, actually, I can see uh, your point, Mali and Fadzila. I know that using a public transport is uh, very good for environment. But in my opinion, I really agree with Shafiq because uh, if you're using a public transport, we have to rush all the time because public transport has their own specific time, right? We doesn't just simply go and we have to wait for a long time. And what if there is a delay in the schedule? And then if there is a delay, the people will become more crowded at that area. And then at the end, you will not, you will uh, get to your place, uh, you will become more late because of the many, many people. And then actually, I think public transport is not efficient in the aspect of time. And like Fazila said, uh, it costs us more cheap than using our own transport. Actually, if we calculate that it again, it is, it is actually the same. The fees that we use for uh, public transport is equal to the uh, money that we spend for our fuel. So, what do you think? Uh, can I ask you some question? I just ask. I want to ask you about your, your first point. Is it relevant for the for the the monorail or something like that to be delayed? Uh, yes, sometimes there will be a technical problem. And then, uh, I don't know if you have uh, read a newspaper about a monorail that burned in KL. So that thing is, uh, in addition actually, the public transport is not really safe. Uh, uh, but, uh, I think we have another choice, right? It's not only monorail. If monorail got broke down, we have a bus, we have a taxi, taxi and the others. But there still will be a delay. Crowded problem cannot be solved. As well, I'm answering the Shafiq answer. I think that the best way is increasing the effectiveness of the public transport. I also want to add about uh, about the disadvantages advantages of using public transport. I think by using the public transport, you, you know that is at this time the crime level is increasing and increasing, right? So. Uh, the hotspot, yeah, hotspot I think, <laughs> hotspot for the crime to be happen, I think it is in the public transport station like bus. In the bus, when people are so crowded, they, the people, the pickpocket, yeah, pickpocketing, the pickpocketing people is really easy to pickpocket other people. So the increasing, the crime will rate will increase. And also, do, do, do you think that uh, with the crime rate increase, the other people who also did uh, involve in this will also increase? So I think for the people who did not want to be pickpocketing, should not be encouraged to use public transport. I see what you mean just now, Shafiq. But uh, however, um, travel by car is often more expensive because uh, when we use uh, public transport like monorail, uh, KTM or something, we just uh, pay for just uh, about um, a ratio of uh, one ringgit uh, per station, I guess. Uh, unless you, you stuck in the jam for, for a long time, so I guess you you just waste your your petrol your time and besides that uh, when uh, when we use public transportation uh, we we have we 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 can do something like uh, very useful like read uh, read something or while while in the while in the monorail. Because of uh, when we drive car, we just like like we in traffic jam. What can we do? We just we just need to focus, focus on, on our driving. Besides, we get mad of the traffic jam, right? Yes. Uh, uh, besides that, I I, I um, it's on the space on the space what we call that on the space side. Uh, we can save a lot of parking lots. Uh, can 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 you imagine that when we have uh, we don't have uh, parking lots like 
everyone is working right so when everyone is working there's there will there will reduce a lot of parking lots so if you are late uh, we are late then they uh, no parking lots uh, no parking lots uh, for you then you still late at the, at the work right so we just have to use uh, public transportation and get uh, to the work on time so do you agree with me? Uh, I think I, I totally agree with you but something that I want to add from the uh, from the Safi point is that did you did you sure that on, only the public transportation would be would be being wrecked, being robbed I think if you use car we also can be robbed or we use a motorcycle or something like that Actually, it's not only rock, but actually for us, human uh, using public transport is actually a burden for us because uh, sometimes there will be a sexual harassment in the public transport, so it will give us no privacy. I understand what, what do you mean, but actually, uh, from my from my point, we should equally effective our public transport. One of the example is we should uh, make a separation between the man and the car and and, and the woman. The one that we have, spot. we already uh, have. Already have like, 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 like. What do you think, Fatima? Okay, I, I, can, uh, I also agree with you. Uh, but I want to add uh, another point. the maintenance of the car or motorbike. I think this is a good point. And another thing that I close my mind is that when we use the we use the bar, we use the car where we are being robbed, so who are going to help us? Because when we use the public transportation, we are being robbed or we need something that goes in our pocket. We can ask the people to help us. So if we are driving the car alone across the road and people stop at us and rob us, so who are we going to to, to get the help? I agree with you. At the moment, I agree with you, uh, Malik. But uh, I I agree with you. Uh, when 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 in uh, public, when we use public transportation, we can depend on others uh, when something happen. Like uh, when you drive car alone, um, normally people who are working uh, they will drive alone uh, to the work, to work. Only few people who um, share share their cars uh, to the to the to the work. Uh, but but I but I think when we, when in public transportation, it will more safe than use um, own car. Do you agree with us? I agree with your point. Because uh, yes, actually, uh, in the aspect of safety, as it is very safe to be able to know what it is for because we are not alone. But in the aspect of the sexual harassment for women, I think it is still not very safe for us. Anyone want to add anything? advantage and advantage all have a good side but the best way to solve, this problem, to solve this problem is by increasing the public transport effectiveness because uh, when we increase the public transport effectiveness it's not only we can, re we can avoid from being late or, or like what uh, as we said uh, for women yet yeah, to save for women we can be more safe if we can put a police or something like that or or in the cap of the monorail or something like that. 
can be more safe, right? So I think the best way is by increasing the effectiveness of the uh, public transport.